John Shumway. We're back up on Route 30 again. This time we are up on Route 30. You can see this is the area that collapsed 11 days ago, dropping uh, the roadway down about 40 or 50 feet, and then down the hillside, down to the apartment complex where the buildings were destroyed. And uh, the perspective of this slope, you realize just how far down it is. We're told it's 150 feet from the roadway of uh, Route 30 down to where the wall is going to be built. And between now and then, what's going to have to happen is most of the fill that's down here is bad fill from the slide. They're going to have to clear that out. And then they're going to have to come in and just basically rebuild the whole hillside back up to a surface that can actually support the roadway so that it can be rebuilt. And the area that collapsed, uh, what they're going to rebuild as far as Route 30 is much further than that. Uh, quite a distance that way, quite a distance this way, so that they're on good ground on both ends and then rebuild it. They're not going to do the whole stretch, just this area will be rebuilt. It'll be all four lanes once they do it. Uh, a lot more answers today about exactly how they're going to do this and the reaction of the contractors to the accelerated uh, schedule to get this job done. And we'll have that story for you coming up tonight on KDK TV News at 5 and 6. I'll see you then.